Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. Come and like a cherry. Come and take a like a cherry. Your oh, boy done switched up on you. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. You guys look. Y'all, if you haven't subscribed to this channel, go ahead on and subscribe for me. And after you subscribe, make sure you hit that notification bell beside the word subscribe so that you'll be notified each and every time that we upload a video. And then, welcome to the family. And guess what? Y'all, we've been in this thing one year. One year, y'all. You guys, this is our official one year anniversary dinner and i chose to have us a seafood boil okay you guys now this is the thing about this seafood boil it is our one year anniversary check this out hold up before i go any further you guys that are new here there's some things that we do and we do them every day because it helps us grow those things are comment 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 like a sharing go for the team comment like a sharing go for the team comment like a sharing don't forget to come in like a share. Come in like a share. Come in like a share. Don't forget to come in like a share. Come in like a share. Come in like a share. Don't forget to. Don't forget to come in like a share. Okay, you guys, check this out. I done told you a little bit of it. I'm going to tell you what's special about this seafood boy when I get back. Let's go ahead and pray so we can get into it. Let's go. Amen. How y'all doing today? How you doing today? How you doing today? Okay, you guys. For our anniversary, I had this cute little idea. One year anniversary, so we're doing a seafood boil of ones, okay? We have one king crab leg, we have one snow crab leg, one prawn, one baby shrimp, one cut up potato, one corn, one green lip mussel, one egg, one cucumber, and one jalapeno. You guys, it's all in here. Everything is drenched in seafood sauce. You guys, that's only one other thing I need to tell you, because he came to the anniversary too. Big Ben is in the building, baby. Big Ben is here. Big Ben is here to help us out, you guys. Because, baby, as you can see, we got to get to eating. Let's see if he's nice and refreshing. Mmm. Mmm. Yes, he am. Okay, you guys. Let's get it. I'll get to the side. I have everything with the Obey. I have the Buffalo Wild Wings, salt and vinegar. And I just got one more thing for you. I forgot. It's my anniversary. Oh, no, beverage. Oh, no, beverage is here, you guys. This is tequila straight for the anniversary. Let's see what it's working with. Oh, you already know the business. Okay, y'all. Here we go for two reasons. For one, we're going to remind you that it's the time, y'all. Well, we have to be wearing our gloves. We got to be being careful. And plus, I don't want all this seafood sauce everywhere. Because it's drenched in here, honey. It's all over everything. And we finna get to eating. Okay, you guys. Just like normal, even though it's already drenched in the seafood sauce. Y'all, I got seafood sauce all over here. I got to obey, and like I said, here we go. If that's your first bite, it's going to be this lovely cucumber, okay? Mmm. Mmm. Mmm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Mmm. Mm. You guys, this sauce that this seafood boil is drenched in is my own sauce. It is the assassin sauce. Now, I'm telling you this for a reason. Let me give me a piece of this potato, y'all. I'm telling you this for a reason. Piece of the potato. Mmm. I haven't had potatoes in my boy in a minute. Okay, y'all. So, for our anniversary, I thought we would go back in time a little bit. You guys, in my intro video, a year ago, March 21st, because today is March 21st for me. It's Saturday. I have on the same shirt, the very same shirt that I had on a year ago. This is the same exact plate. I don't have the same cup, but I also did my introductory video with my own assassin sauce. So today, I thought it was only appropriate. So now, with that being said, now you know what we're doing. How y'all doing today? Let's go and get this little baby shrimp out of the way. He up here in the front. Mm. 
I have one baby film and one prawn, y'all. It's the seafood boil of ones. That way there. We got seafood boil of ones. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm-mm-mm. -mm. Mm -hmm. That potato was good. They were real good. Mm. Mm-hmm. So how y'all doing today? I hope you guys are doing very, very well. I am on top of the moon. Y'all, we made it to one year. We made 26K in this year, y'all. And almost 3 million views. Yes, I said it right. Almost 3 million views, y'all. The Lip Channel has been viewed almost 3 million times. You guys are simply amazing. You guys are simply amazing. Y'all, let's go down memory lane just a little bit. Y'all, we started this thing. I created the channel on March 18th, 2018, okay? I remember because, you guys, my parents, as you know, and I talked about it in my original video. Mmm. Mmm. July. Of 2016, I lost my father in a car accident. And six months later, on February the 8th, I lost my mom. Um, and a month later, after I lost my mom, March the 20th, I got hurt on my job. I got hurt, which in turn um, brings you to the handicap that I have now. Well, the disability, because I'm not handicapped. So when I hurt myself on my job, y'all, mm, y'all, it's good. When I hurt myself on my job, mm, I hurt myself to the point where For nine months, y'all, mm, I laid flat on my back, and I could not walk. I could not get up. We did physical therapy. We did occupational therapy. We did it all. Cycle after cycle after cycle for nine months. Well, at the time, Little Lips was maybe four and my husband was working. So I was at home, me and Lil' Lips, every day. And we would be delivering food and stuff. And what we would do, we had two 110 pound, 185 pound pit bulls that were in the home with us. So y'all some eat. So it wasn't like that we were just here alone. But what we would do, on the second level of our home, hubby would go to work every day, and he would lock myself and Little Lips upstairs in our bedroom. There was a bathroom in there and everything, so we were good. But when we ordered food, I would look out the window, but when we ordered food, I would look out the window and see whomever was bringing the food, watch them come in the door. They'd be already paid. And I would have instructions for them like to call me when they got to my home. And they would. And they would call me, y'all. And I would have them come in the inside the door and leave the food, you know. Mm. And then they could leave. I would put the tip, you know, on the credit card prior to them getting here. So, I would have to send my four-year-old daughter downstairs, y'all, to get the food. Okay? Now, at first, 
It seemed like a smart idea. Until one day, we does this. And for some reason, uh, this day with the delivery, it was Pizza Hut. There was some type of delay with the person. And I was so used to doing it that I got lazy, y'all. I got lazy and then watch them leave or get back in their vehicle, you know what I'm saying, before they left. So Lil Lips ended up downstairs with this young man. He was a nice young man, but that was a mistake that I wasn't willing to continue to make or even make it be a possibility that I was going to make. So, mmm. I start working real, real hard, y'all, and trying to get up out of the bed. My daughter was too young, and I wanted to be able to, you know, live out life with her and not be in a wheelchair and couldn't do nothing with her. You know, I couldn't play with her. I couldn't do anything. So, with that being said, um, mmm. Finally, I got a little better. I went from the wheelchair to a walker. And I stayed on a walker a long time. And then, finally, I was able to progress to getting in a, on a cane. You know, I walk on a cane. Uh, I still need assistance, but, you know, I didn't have to be with that great big old A wheelchair or a walker. So, with that being said, backtracking a little bit. One day, me and Lil Lips was in the bed. We were just sitting there, y'all. And she had been telling me that she wanted me to start YouTube. Now, at this time, y'all, my only involvement... Oh, I forgot to tell y'all, we got one sausage in here, too. I forgot about my sausage. So, at this time, y'all, my only... The only thing I knew to look up on YouTube was something how to fix a car. I know I don't know how to do nothing to no car, but change door. So, what am I doing? What am I doing? Okay. So with that being said, one day we're sitting there, y'all. Now my daughter's four years old. Okay? So one day we're sitting there, and she has, like I said, this obsession with YouTube. And one day, mm, mm, come on here now. I was you know, paying attention, but not paying attention to what she was doing. And I heard this song, y'all. Must bang. Are we banging? I must bang. You know, she four years old. So that bang word caught my attention, y'all. That caught my attention. Four years old, the word bang just didn't work right for me. So with that being said, look over, I ask her, what you looking at? Is that grown folks stuff? She said, no, it ain't grown folks stuff. No, sir. It ain't grown folks stuff. It's just somebody eating. I had never seen a mukbang before, y'all. Never knew that mukbang existed at this time. As you guys know, the one of you guys, I'm sure some of you guys that are watching already know, this entertainer was Yummy Bites, which was the first mukbang that I ever laid my eyes on. Yummy Bites. So, after I investigated and began to see that, okay, yeah, okay, oh, well, this is all right. You know, child approved. After I did that, y'all, it did pique my interest. I was like, okay. But they just eating. I was like, why do you, you know, why do you want to watch people eat? At that time, she was four, y'all. So it was a lot of 
You know that kind of thing. So, because I had seen what it was, I wasn't overly worried. Because she's just watching people eat. So I told my husband about it. And he was like, well, it's all right. Mm. Now, after that, I found Terrell and Goddamn Zoe. That's his name. I found those two. You know, through Yummy Bites, just watching Yummy Bites. At this time, y'all, I didn't know how to make no comment. I didn't know how to do nothing. Just push on the video. And whatever video came behind it is what I watched. I didn't know how to do anything else. So I started watching, and I didn't even know how to subscribe, y'all. I didn't. So I finally figured out how to subscribe. And watching those three entertainers. Well, like I said, Lil Lips wanted me to do YouTube. She was like, I want you to do that. So I started watching. I started watching. And baby, one day, y'all, which you also hear in my introductory video, I did start finding other entertainers. Um... You know, uh, several of them I found. Um, I did. I found B Love, Simply Food by TY. Um, you know, I found several of them, y'all. But one day, some kind of way, y'all. <laughs> hey! My screen, some kind of way, y'all got on Eat With You. Honey. The day I found Eat With Q was the day that my YouTube journey started. I found Eat With Q and I fell in love with her. I fell in love with her mostly because she ate like me. You know what I'm saying? She was a vibrant personality. She smacked. Mm-hmm. She popped her lips. You even burped. So I was like, hmm. Maybe I can do this. So then, y'all, I started really paying attention. Mm-hmm. I started watching, you know, how she drew me in. You know, you know her conversation was on point. She was gorgeous. So I was like, maybe I can do that. You know, if this lady, you know, because for all account, she ate just like I did. The true way I eat. So, I decided I was going to do it. And honey, March 21st, 2019, I uploaded my first video. It was a seafood bar on this very same plate, sitting in this very same chair at this very same table. It was. And Eat With Q, that was my favorite mukbang. Oh, my God. She was just so, 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 so. She was everything to me because she was just like me. You know, so anyway, y'all, that's where it got started. And from here to there, y'all, we started this thing um, 37 days after we started. Let me show y'all this king crab first. Baby. Y'all, 37 days after we started this YouTube channel. Ooh, that didn't go right, y'all. I'm going to do a little work there. 37 days. Mm-hmm. We ain't gonna say it on this video. We're gonna try to be cute. Y'all, 37 days after we started this YouTube channel, I had hit 1K. But let me tell you, during those 31st, 37 days, I met you, Love Shiny. <laughs> I did. Y'all, when I met you, Love Shiny, 
I had maybe, I don't know y'all, maybe 300 subscribers, maybe. I'm, yeah, I say around 300 subscribers is what I had. I met Yulo Shane, and uh, she was so motivational. And, um, you know, I started to build a relationship with her. And me and Yulo Shane have been friends ever since, y'all. But then, that was in March. I probably met Shani somewhere, maybe mid-April. Mm-hmm. Somewhere along the lines, y'all. Somewhere along the line. Mm. 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 I ran across another fabulous entertainer. Her name was Sam's World. <laughs> yes, I did, y'all. I ran into Sam's World some kind of way. I didn't know how. But I did. And at the time, Sam was doing Seven Days of Seafood. She was doing Seven Days of Seafood. And she quickly became, you know what I'm saying, diehard Q fan. But... Um, y'all, I was captivated by Sam's World. I was. Sam's World just captivated me. She did. She was doing Seven Days Seafood. The first episode I saw her with, her nephew Jordan went on there. It was just her. So, anyway... And then, y'all, time just kept going, kept going. But like I said, 37 days later, we had our 1K. So after we got our 1K, nine days later, day 46, we got monetized. We got monetized, y'all. Baby. Y'all, I could just sit back and think about it. So I remember when I first... We got in contact with Sam's World. Sam used to run like an overnight live. Because uh, she had just started in December herself. But she used to run an overnight live at night. I think she was um, in the process of getting monetized herself. And then I met this lady named Tangia Fremont. Fremont. Tangia Fremont. And Sam's World's Live. Honey, me and Tangent Fremont is still friends to this very day. Y'all, I remember that after I had been in the live, you know what I'm saying, just going on, 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 on. Finally, one night, I had Sam's World's attention. And I told her that I had a channel too. She wasn't too overly concerned with it, I'm sure. Like I know now. You know, you hear that all the time. So, finally, I don't know what it was that she said. But I messed around and said something to her about my nails or something. I don't got what it was that, that you know, got her attention. But, baby, when I said something to her, she said, hold on a minute. Let me see what you talking about, honey. And she went to my channel right there on the live. She did. And y'all, the rest is history. Me and Sam's World are the best friends in the world. We really, really are. I mean, we're inseparable. That's my sister. It is. That's my sister. And y'all, like I said, the rest is history, honey. The rest is history. And I started collecting all of you. Yes, I did. I started collecting all of you. And y'all, one year later... There's 26.2 thousand of y'all, and this show done been watched three million times. Almost three million, y'all. Almost three million views. Baby, that's why we're the Legion. <laughs> For real, y'all. For real, real, real. That's how it all went down. <clears throat> it did. Y'all am overjoyed. 
that I have been on YouTube a year. I'm overjoyed that we hit 26K. I'm overjoyed that you're here with me right now. I am. I really, really am, y'all. Y'all just don't know. YouTube. I really into me y'all in so many ways. YouTube changed my life. Now, if you had to tell me a year and one day ago, well, a year and four days ago, because I actually made the channel three days before I had put anything up on it. Now, if you had to tell me a year and four days ago, that I was going to be sitting here March 21st, 2020, in the middle of a pandemic. With 26.2K subscribers. Doing my celebration video. But I will tell you, I cannot believe you. I would have. <sighs> Y'all, I can remember when I very first started. You know, you kind of scared. So I couldn't get my personality out. I was kind of quiet a little bit. You know, all the antics that you get now that's really mean. I couldn't get all of it out. I couldn't get it out, y'all. My earlier videos, they're a lot calmer than my videos now. Because I couldn't get my personality out. I just couldn't. I think the screen, the camera, it intimidated me. It did. I mean, I just couldn't get my personality out. I just could not. But finally, we got there. Each video, I got a little more me. A little more me. A little more me. Mm-hmm. And then, I remember, y'all, when we first started, like, I cooked every day. Mm-hmm. Like, for a month and a half. I didn't know anything. Y'all, I used to get up every morning. Either I would cook my food in the crock pot the night before, or I would get up early in the morning when hubby went to work and I would start my food. And I would get my food ready. And by 12 o'clock when the young and the rest went off, I would be recording my video. I didn't know how to put the video in private. I didn't know nothing. All I knew is when I put that video up, I had maybe an hour to get it ready. You know, to make my description box and stuff and... All that kind of stuff. And then when it got through, it was just published. I'd be out to the public. But I found a way every day with knowing nothing, with knowing nothing, y'all, to get that video out every day. I did. I really, really did. I really, really did, y'all. I remember when I uploaded my first video, y'all, I didn't even know how to upload the video. I didn't. I had to contact Simply Food by T.Y. to ask him questions on basically how to upload the video. I did. I knew nothing at all. I had no direction. What I did know is that I felt like that I could do it. I believed in myself. You know, y'all, it took me months to get production to come on the show. He was like, I ain't doing it. He still don't be want to do it now, y'all. If it wasn't for Deborah Lee, Deborah Lee and the vet down, and y'all have hoped me. Yes, y'all have. Because before y'all, baby, it was like pulling teeth to get him on this video. Wherever you are. And I have met some amazing people along the way. I have. I really have. Some of y'all, some of my, some of y'all have been with me a long time. Um... And then, you know, I mean, I would not trade my journey on YouTube. <laughs> Outside of the health of my family, my strength in the Lord, I don't know. I, I wouldn't trade my journey on YouTube for anything. I wouldn't. All the good and the bad. It taught me a lot about me. It really, really did. It taught me a lot about me. And y'all, it's just amazing. And today, I sit here with, you know, Sam's World, hashtag the cannons. One of my super followers, um, LeVette Wardell. 
You love shiny Big Mac. And we say on the phone, we encourage each other. You know, man, I just, I just wouldn't trade this journey that you are now seeing. I wouldn't trade it for the world. I've had a ball, y'all, doing this. I really have. I've had a ball. All of you guys are so encouraging. You're so loving to me and my family. And y'all, I just want to say thank you. At the end of the day, I just want to say thank you. I really, really do. Y'all, I didn't come to stay no long time, even though I probably didn't stay long than I thought I was going to stay. But y'all, I just wanted to come and go down memory lane a little bit. Let you know I love y'all. And let y'all know this has been one year. It's been one year, y'all. For me, one year today. Um, I'm pretty sure it'll be a couple days before you see this video. But I had to come and give you a one-year official, one-year celebration meal. I hope you have enjoyed. I hope you guys have enjoyed. I love you guys so, 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 so much. And I look forward to spending many, many more years with you. Not that many, y'all, because I'm getting old. I cannot be on here forever. But I wanted to be on here for a while, you guys. And I hope that you guys continue to pray for us, continue to be there for us, support us, just continue to love us. We love each and every one of you guys. Me and my family want to say thank you, thank you, thank you for an amazing year. I love each and every one of you guys. You guys are simply amazing. You're simply amazing, you guys. We love you all. I love me. I love you. I particularly love us. That's why we're the Legion. And we've been on this job one year. One year, y'all. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Cheers to you, Legion. Cheers to you for an amazing one year. I love you all. I love you all. Let's take it for the team. Ah. Uh, oh, let me, let me take this. This here look good. Let me eat the last one, y'all. Let me eat the last one. Mmm. Y'all, I'm going to see y'all in the next video. I'm going to see you in the next video. I love you guys so, so much. Well, like I said, I hope you guys have enjoyed. Remember the gloves to remind you, keep yourself covered up. Keep yourself healthy. Don't forget. Don't forget, y'all. I love each and every one of you guys. To all my new legion. To each and every one of my new legion. I love each and every one of you guys. Thank you so much for being here. You could have been anywhere else in the world, but you chose to be here with us. And we love you for it. To all my existing legion. All my ride or dies. All my super supporters. All my everything, y'all. I love you guys so, so much. I love you so, so much, okay? And well, I'm going to see you guys on the next video, okay? Big Ben says goodnight. <laughs> you guys don't forget again, didn't you? I didn't forget. Big Ben says goodnight. I love you guys so, so much. I really do. I'm going to see y'all tomorrow, okay? Well, I'm going to see you on the next video. I'm going to see you in the next video. I love y'all so much. I don't want to go. But I'm going to see y'all next time, okay? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. You guys look. Always remember that there's always more than one way home. All you decide to do is get there. So get there, people. Get there. I love you all. And I'm going to see you guys next time. And if you're not going to watch me next time, you have lied to me. And I know you lied. Period. <laughs> Bye bye. Mm. Thank you guys for one year. I love you guys so 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 much. I love you, Legion. I'm gonna see y'all next time. Okay. Bye bye.